beauty contest? Well, the woman didn't make her face. If she made it, you know, straighten out the nose and everything, I could see giving her a medal. But if she's born beautiful, why give her a contract or a prize? Do you understand what I mean? If he's an artist, and say he's born that way, he's gifted, well, why give him any awards if he's born that way? Well, you have to read a book ten times, he reads it once and remembers every word. If he's born with a different brain, with, with a different associative system, if your brain has been damaged by white lead, you're not to blame for it. When you take the kids to school, you take them out when they're five or six years old, and the teacher doesn't send them in for a checkup to see how, whether their circulation, their brain is operated normal, whether they have problems physically, whether verbal behavior, whether the parents instructed the children or not. Like uh, an impoverished black family or Mexican family can't always answer question when the kid says, uh, Papa, what keeps the boon up there? There's no struts, nothing holding it up there. He says, you know, what do I know about that? <laughs> Don't bother me with that stuff. But if you're fairly well educated, you can tell them about repulsive gravitational fields. You can, by the time your kid's six, he has a different associative system than a poor kid whose family was never educated in that area. So they give him different grades. That's the worst thing you can do. If I give you an A and him an F a failure, the other kids feel jealous and envious. You're producing all those feelings. So Catholic priest said to me, I know two kids from the same environment. One became a priest, the other a gangster. If environment is everything, how do you get those differences? If you have two kids and you treat the younger kid, play with it, while the seven-year-old is standing there with his lip out, like that, <laughs> while you're playing with it, you're making jealousy and envy. You never take the younger kid and play with it. Say, why can't you be like your sister? She puts everything away and you leave everything hanging and I have to pick up after you. you, you when you fall down the stairs, your sister has a grin on her face. You understand what I mean?